Prevent the Cycle is a social justice organization here in Lynn that started in 2020 after the murder of George Floyd and helped organize a couple of rallies and protests in the community. Um, they've done a lot of work around voter education and activating young people, educating them about the, the importance of voting and local politics. Um, and right now we're also working on a diverse book initiative in partnership with The Real Program. So today we are here with Reading Without Borders. This is a program, a, a diverse book crawl, if you will. Um, we're set up all around Lynn at different parks, uh, offering free hot chocolate, uh, book readings for, for young people, as well as activities that they can either do here or take home. So I, I feel that people should take away that, you know, there are multicultural authors, there are multi, multicultural characters within books. Reading the book today to the, um, the young people that I read my book to, they were saying how the person in the book looks like them. And they were pointing out how it looks like their brother or their sister, and that's really important to be able to see yourself within the stories, and that's what um, a part of this initiative is all about, is making sure that our community is seeing themselves in books and in other media. Uh, we're here till 3. The activities go on till 3 today. Um, so we're here at Katy Park, right outside of Lynn English High School, and there are a few more locations this afternoon that folks can uh, go and enjoy um, and bring reading and enjoy reading with each other um, and then bring reading home too.